over the past few videos, I've been deleting a lot of Windows important folders and registries and my Windows computer is literally right. But today, once again, I'm deleting one of the most important folders, System32 in Windows XP, one of my old laptop's computers. Let's see if this Windows XP cries once again. If we generally go to the Windows System32 folder and try to delete it, no, it is not possible. Windows does not give the permission to delete it. But I have found the cheeky way of deleting Windows System32 folder. In order to delete the System32 folder, we have to open CMG as in command prompt. Once after doing that, I have to type the command DEL asterisk. Do you want to delete the Windows folder? Yes, I really want to do it. Let's enter it. Even though the system is telling deny, 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 I think that the system files kind of get corrupted and cannot be re reused. Let's take a reboot and then see system32 xp folder. During the reboot, this error shows. Windows could not start because of the following file is missing or corrupt. Please reinstall the copy of the files. Whoa, that's what happens if you delete the system32 folder in Windows XP. Never ever try to do this even at your own risk. That's all for this video. Make sure you subscribe this channel. Follow for more. Peace.